I played club lacrosse at Virginia Tech. And uh, after graduating and moving to Indiana, I got uh, quite a bit into bicycling. I was uh, road biking a ton. Right from the beginning, the doctor said they didn't know and that only time would tell whether I would get function back in my hands, in my arms, in my legs. Before surgery, all Chris could do really was shrug his shoulders. In one arm, he had a little bit of the ability to raise it, but that was it. The significance of this is that in the past, when a patient came in with a cervical spinal cord injury, my discussion with them was, there's nothing we can do. Now, my discussion with them is, we have a treatment which will return some of your function and take you from being completely dependent upon others for everything to being able to live relatively independently. And after my stem cell injection, I slowly was able to raise my left arm up to my face and then up, um, you know, to my head and then, you know, finally able to raise my arms up high in the air. The data are showing uh, for this 10 million cell group that at one year, two thirds of them have regained two levels of motor function. Now that's vastly better than anything we've ever seen before. Um, five to six months after the stem cell injection, I was able to put on my own clothes, uh, my upper body, dress the upper half of my body and uh, shower my upper body. Normally, following a spinal cord injury, you will improve for a month or two, and that's it. We're 12 months out, and these patients are still getting better. That's remarkable.